Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel and thank you so much for being here. We have a lot of stuff to talk about today. We'll go pretty quickly, but I have some great items. <gasps> Been around the channel you know we fall a little behind during our fat fit fun season but i want to be sure and show you everything that i got because of the way that these spoilers worked with the months i have duplicates of some of our stuff so these are our vela box i have two vela boxes i love that it gives me the opportunity to show you guys a couple of different scents if you have not heard me talk about vela box before vela box is an artisan candle company they work with different artisan candle makers to develop better for you candles that you can use without worrying about all of the toxins that you have to worry about in generally mass-produced candles. They're paraben-free, phthalate-free, so there's no petroleum. They use, of course, a cotton lead-free wick. I just feel so much better about burning these, or I should say melting these. <laughs> I should say melting these, than I do my regular old-fashioned like Bath and Body Work candles, which I used to burn constantly, and now I almost never burn because I always use one of these. I will link again, I'll just link it every time I talk about Velabox, my candle warmer that I use. I have so many of these now that I have been collecting because I use my candle warmer, and when you use it, what it does is the light just melts down the top of the candle wax, and I haven't had one yet where the scent has dissipated. So I use the scent that I feel like using. When I turn the candle off, it hardens back up. I tuck it back down where I keep all of my candles. I switch them out every few days. Sometimes there's a specific scent that I'm after. I use it for that. If you did that for a while and then you thought, hey, I wanna light this candle, absolutely no reason you couldn't. Your wick is still there. Your wick is still fine. These are two gorgeous canvases. Can you see those? Little box does send me these boxes for free and I am an affiliate with them, but because of that, we have Catherine 50, which when you go over and check them out, if you decide that it's something that you'd like to receive, you will get 50% off your first box. They do four ounce, eight ounce, and 16 ounce candles. Each month, you will also get a bonus. I guess I better gloss up to tell you what this is. Something in a roller ball. This is Lavender Silk Fragrance Roll-On. What does that tell us? This is our first ever release of a fragrance roll-on. Apply as you would perfume or cologne to your pulse points, temples, wrists, neck, and behind the ears. Reapply as needed to maintain scent. And this has a $22 value. I can't put it on because I just unboxed my FabFitFun and I put the vacation on. But we can certainly see what, oh, well, or I could just put it on my finger. Oh, that's very nice. It's a nice, it's definitely a lavender scent. Let me get that off my finger before I touch it on everything. It is a nice lavender scent, but it's not too, too strong, but definitely lavender -y. I like lavender and lavender essential oils, is that what this is? Can have some therapeutic value, so. Sweet almond oil, hazelnut oil, grapeseed oil, fragrance oil, which we know is lavender. Okay. And our candle this month, look at the pretty blue. My canvas is so nice. I collect these. I use them for many and varied things. All of our candles either come, generally speaking, all of our candles either come in this color or a brown color that you've maybe seen me unbox, glass. And then this is usually, is it, is it ever silver? I think it's usually gold or black. The black one tends to come on the brown. I don't know if we get a silver one or not. Oh, don't cheat. This is Rose West Citrus and Hinoki. That is what it looks like. I won't read any more words, so it's not a giveaway. I can guess it's some of the scents, although they have kind of helped, oh, citrus. They have kind of helped me with citrus. I'm not sure what Hinoki is. That smells so good. Wow. This is my favorite one that I've received in a while. I like them all, but I do have favorites. And I didn't even know that I had favorites until I started using my candle warmer and I would keep reaching back for the same one. I haven't smelled the other one yet, but as of right now, this one's going straight on the candle warmer today. It's so fresh and light. It smells so good. What is, it's citrus, but there's something else to it. I don't think it's the Hinoki because I don't know what that is. I feel like there's something else in here I know. Our candle of the month is from Rose West Studio. They launched an effort to provide customers with handcrafted earth conscious products inspired by curiosity and driven by our community. This is a place where scent is transformative and your experience is immersive. 
Each item they produce is thoughtfully and carefully handcrafted in small batches to ensure the highest quality possible across all products. This is number 007, Citrus and Hinoki. It is yuzu, maybe that's the scent, bergamot, tangerine, passion fruit, guava, hinoki, and apricot wood. It's, so as you can imagine, it's just fruity and so full of citrus. Tease that sweet summer feeling with this energized, sunny scent. Well, as luck would have it, I didn't happen to open it until it got warm, and I am ready for this scent. That is amazing. And our second box, this one is even more beautiful, and I can see what our bonus is in there. We have a nice, I'm gonna guess, body brush. Look how gorgeous that is. When you sign up for Velobox, you will fill out a questionnaire because each month they generally offer three candles from the artisan they work with. They will ask you your favorite colors, your flavors, what scents you like, so many questions. And then they will send you the candle that best suits the answers to your profile each month. This is a bamboo scrub brush, an eco-friendly solution for your kitchen cleaning. So it's not a body brush, it's for your dishes. This is crafted from natural bamboo, a rapidly renewable source, and sisal and palm, which offer a biodegradable alternative to traditional plastic bristles. Oh, and look, and it, and it has a little hole, so if you wanted to, you could put a string on it. Okay, we have the CH, which is Cart House Blossom Festival. That is what that looks like. So, I just told the whole story about the colored lids we get, and white. I forgot about the white ones. Oh, wow, this is great. This, I can already tell you right now, it's going in our bedroom. That is lovely. It's kind of floral, but there's something in it that makes it not, and I'm gonna use these words, and if you don't like florals, please don't take it the wrong way. It's not obnoxiously floral. It's floral, but there's something else to it. Um, maybe, ooh, it might be rose, but I told him I like rose. You could say, I hate rose. I said, I love rose, because that might be rose. This is, oh, other side. This is Blossom Festival Floral, Sweet, and Spice. Cherry Blossom, Ozone, Jasmine, probably the Jasmine, Red Currant, Tonka Bean, Musk, and Sandalwood. Yeah, all of those things. That's why I said it would be a perfect bedroom fragrance. It's floral, but then it has that musk of the sandalwood under there. Indulge your senses into the smells of the spring with strong scents of cherry blossom and fresh ozone. You almost feel like you're walking among the cherry blossom trees. Well, I've walked among the cherry blossom trees and they don't smell this good. They're beautiful, don't get me wrong, beautiful. This smells better, that is fantastic. As luck would have it, I don't have to choose which one I wanna use because this one for now would be perfect in the bedroom. My only sad part about using this in the bedroom is it means I'm gonna burn it. I should probably get a candle warmer for the bedroom too. Great idea, guys. I like the way you think. So those were my two Vela boxes that I have received. Each month you receive a candle. You can choose the size, four, eight, or 16 ounces, and your price is based on that. You get the bonus regardless of which one you choose. And these are the two months and the two bonuses that we got. And I will link the candle warmer down below too. Don't forget with code Catherine50, you get 50% off your first box. That's a good deal. I also have two months of my Mint Mongoose. Mint Mongoose is a jewelry subscription. You subscribe, you let her know what you'd like. Each month you will get a necklace and earrings or a necklace and bracelet, or you can get all three if you want. You can choose rose gold, silver, yellow gold. You can choose surprise me, whichever you'd like. And each month she picks the jewelry we receive based on something that's happening in her life. And Helena started this company so she could stay home with her babies. We also get a Werther Original each month, and this is our pack. I am not sure that I'm opening these in the right order, so. And these are sent to me for review, and I will put my link down below, and I will let you know here what you get for signing up because it does change at times. First, we have the earrings. So pretty, they look kind of opaline. That is so pretty. Definitely something I would wear every day. I like when earrings have a little bit of heft to them. Where are my ears? <laughs> I like when earrings have a little bit more heft to them so that you can, oh, I like that because of the darkness of my hair. Those will show up so nicely. Anyway, I like when I have a little more heft to them because of my long hair, it makes them much easier to see. Yeah, those are really pretty. Okay, and then you also get a necklace with it. Oh, this one's pretty. It's different. It has a chain that's different on it. It's like there's little stations. Can you see them on the chain? And then it kind of matches just to back to the earrings. You will have your extender. I always say, I think these would easily fit to a 
20 inch extension. I really like this set. It is perfect for summer. Let's see what's in the other one. It's like a crashing wave. This one set is kind of based on the ocean and how fun is that? These are the earrings. Can you tell the blue of them? And they've got, and the bottoms are the gold tone. Those are so pretty. And then we have two necklaces. I'm sure because of the gold and the blue on those, these are meant to be layered. So we have the gold. It's like the bottom of that earring. And then this nice disc that's, how can I best show that? There we go. That is like the, there we go. That is like the earring, but then with the gold disc down below, it matches back to the circle and the gold of the earring. That is such a pretty set. That is a super, super fun summer set. This is Mint Mongoose. I will put the link down below to send you over to check them out. It is sent to me for review. And it's always such fun costume jewelry. I enjoy getting it each month. Tell you what, it's so warm here, I decided to pull my hair up. Next, and this is sent to me by me. <laughs> I am in no way affiliated with Vegamore. I have just been using it for a year. I will tag them doing the tagging that I can do with YouTube to send you over to Sephora. You can go to Vegamore and check it out. This is the Grow Shampoo and conditioner. I have been using this for probably almost a year now. I started with the serum back in like January of last year and then early summer, late spring, early summer, I added the shampoo and conditioner. I love the way it smells. It's kind of a floral scent. It's kind of a pezzy scent, but this is the Vegamore Grow. I use the Grow. They have a Grow Plus. I don't use the Grow Plus because it has hemp oil in it. I think it's hemp oil. And generally my face, so I'm gonna assume my head has not been happy with that kind of product. So I just use the Grow. I use the serum. I use the Grow shampoo and conditioner. I'm going to do a whole video on it where I show the difference in my hair from the videos that I've made and that kind of thing. But just to tell you right now, it's made a huge difference. You can go back, I think probably, and look at my videos at the beginning of my channel and see my hair. Granted, I keep thinking I'm going to make the Vegamore video, but I need a haircut. <laughs> I need a color really bad before I bring you guys in tight on my hair. So I know a lot of you so often ask for updates to the Vegamore video, and I'm going to do that. But just know I'm using the Grow Serum. I'm using the shampoo and conditioner. I'm trying to wash my hair only every other day when I need a dry shampoo, which I don't use it every day that I don't wash my hair. I don't necessarily use that. I only use it if like we're going out and it's toward the end of the day and I feel like, you know how sometimes your hair doesn't smell to suit you? I use it for that. Is there anything else Vegamore? Oh, I did the Vegamore Hydrate, which is the thing you put on the end to protect it thermally and it's kind of a leave-in conditioner. I probably won't do that again. It worked fine. It smells nice. It's really thick. And I didn't realize when I did it that it has none of the grow properties in it. It's just a leave-in conditioner. And I have used other leave-in conditioners uh, that I like, Briogeo, that kind of thing, just as well. So I probably won't necessarily order it again, but the shampoo, the conditioner, and the serum, I don't ever want to be without. It has made such a difference in my hair. So I just thought I would unbox this so it would give me the opportunity to eyeball you guys because I know so many of you have been asking, what am I doing with my hair? It's Vecamore and I'm loving it. I'll link it in tags. And last but not least, I have my journal junk box and this is all changing. This is sent to me for review. I get the regular journal junk box. I get the journal junk sack, which is on top, and I get the kids creative. They are streamlining, changing things up a bit over a journal junk box. We'll talk about that more in June. I will still link it all down below so you guys can go over and check it out. And with my code Catherine Love, you will get 15% off your first box. Okay, let's start with the sack. We will go through these. The sack is just like the journal junk box. You will have a book, you will have a pen, maybe some stickers, that kind of thing. It's the same theme as the journal junk box and it follows the same formula. It's just a smaller package. We have an inspiration card that's, I am a beacon of light inspiring others with my kindness and compassion. I use these sometimes, I just put them under a magnet up on my fridge. When they speak to me at a certain time, you know, you're going through things, different things speak to you. I've used them as bookmarks. We have our journal junk card with all of the socials on the back. I will leave that for a second in case you wanna pause the camera and give it a look-see. May is Floral Reflections. That is what that looks like. We have the Blossom Haven sticker pack. Can you guys tell how big this is? 
these are all stickers. These will be so great for like in your journaling, in your calendars, whatever you keep that you wanna just make a little prettier. I will probably set some aside for the girls too. These are so, so pretty. We have, what is this? Oh, I love these and I need new ones. These are, I know, this is a weird thing to be so excited about. They're car coasters, is that what they call them? Yes, keep going, car coaster set of two. One says, choose joy, and one says, keep going. And you just put them down in the cup holders in your car, and they are the stone like you can use in your house. Here, let me show you. That absorbs. This is the kind that really absorbs. Can you hear it? Really absorbs liquid well. It has the little, I always thought, why do they leave that? But when I went to take one out, it was very handy. My husband and I are in the process of buying a new car, so I will have new ones for my new car, and I'm very happy about that. Then we have our pen and our book. These are both really pretty. You give life to what you give energy to. And then two pens. Oh, I love this book. This is one of the books that is, I think I'm right. Let's see if I'm right. Yes, is Lay Flat because the binding, it has a name. I forget it every time, but it's a flat binding that allows it to lay flat. I love that. And it's just nice lined paper. You can make your notes, make your lists happy lists and keep them in there. And then we have two pretty pens. One is just kind of cloudy and one is just floral. Super pretty. Love getting new fun pens. The girls love it. They come, they take the pens they want to. Everybody enjoys journal junk box over here. Next, I'll do my May journal junk box. Same formula as the journal junk sack. We have all of our paperwork on top. And when we open it up, you can mostly just see the peanuts, but we'll get past them. Our card in this one says, I am radiant with inner peace and overflowing with love. Isn't that pretty? We have our card that tells us a little bit about what the month is about. It gives us some journaling prompts in case you're new to journaling and you're not sure what you wanna say. Week one, imagine your life as a garden. What would you plant more of and why? Very deep thoughts. First out on top, we've got this big box. Let's just see what it is. Kate Aspen, Garden Blooms, Ceramic Coasters for In the House. That is so nice. The ones that I'm using now actually came in a different box. They're beachy. So I'm kind of happy to change it up. We'll see what these look like. There's six and it has a coaster holder. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. They are, are they all the same? Nope. They are the kind, and I know it's hard to get across, but they're very porous. These aren't, a lot of times they're painted with something that makes them less porous. These are not. These are the very porous kind. So we have two of that design. This is amazing. I love these. Bloom where you are planted. We have two of that design. And then we have two of these. Yes, we have two of this design. This kind of has like a minty green to it. I like that a lot. I am so excited to put these downstairs. Look, they have their own little holder. That's a really fun thing to get in a journal junk box. I love these coasters. They get old, tattered, and I am happy to have a new set. That is very exciting. Next up, we have more stickers. These are Bloom Beautiful. Let's look at a couple of these. So do these tend to be? Yes. These ones just tend to be bigger single plants. The other ones were like bouquet type things. This is, yeah, this is just like more like single plant type things. Oh no, there's a nice bouquet. It's just a different pack. These are so cool. I will absolutely use these in my planner. I love this kind of thing. The girls will like them also. Next up, I have a Sergeant Art washable broad tip markers. Markers are always handy. I do use them in my journaling, absolutely. Also, the girls love them. So these will be super handy. There's some great colors in there. They don't all look like the same run of the mill colors. Ooh, a pencil case, Kindness Matters. It says that on both sides. I'm sure, pretty sure one of my girls will grab this up. This is pretty cool. This one actually, Feels like one that would be great, not for school, but for the pool to tuck in a backpack because it's plastic. So it's going to be water resistant to stop things from getting to it. So if they're taking things to the pool that they'd really rather not get wet, this would be a great thing to tuck in their backpack. Ooh. Next we have a notepad. These are so handy. I love to have these around. I am a note taker. I am a note leaver. Hey babe, on my way to Starbucks, text me if you want anything because sometimes we cross paths. Hello, beautiful journal junk. I am, it's probably because it's spring here and it's so beautiful, but I am loving all of these 
florals. I, I'm loving it. Um. Next out, and this was outside the box, and I wasn't sure which one it went with. It goes with this one. It is a self-care artist coloring book. It's an adult coloring book. If you guys watch the channel at all, you know I love these. Two of my granddaughters are older also. They've moved beyond coloring, but sometimes they sit with the littles just because they're such great big sisters. They sit with the littles and color. So I love to have these around for them so they can color more challenging. You know what I mean? Instead of, instead of just coloring big pictures of Bluey, <laughs> they have other things. Not that Bluey is not fantastic. Bluey is fantastic. But then they have other things. Time to unwind, create moments of joy, feed your soul. So they're all, they're all inspirational sayings, but then with pictures around them, that's kind of fun. I would like them. I, I like to color. I like to color. If I wasn't spending so much time doing my diamond art painting, I ordered another one. I should show you guys this. Maybe in my next unboxing, which I may tape in a few minutes, I'll show you one that I finished. It's so fun, but this seems cool. And then last out, we have our book and our pens. Our book is a nice spiral, so it will also lay flat. It says notes. Something about this just, probably the pinkness of it, something about this just screams my mom to me. Oh, and it's even got florals on the bottom. I will hope that that shows. I think she might really like this, so I'll have to ask her when she sees this if this is a book she'd like to have because that's really pretty. These pens are gorgeous too. I would say it's from the same company because the packaging feels the same, but these are prettier. Don't tell Journal Junk Sack. We don't want to hurt its feelings, but these pens, I don't know if you can tell, but their base colors, that light blue, that lighter kind of, this one's almost clear. These two are almost clear. They're kind of transparent coloring. And then they've got the other painting on it. I love the way these feel. And then they have these silicone bottoms. I love these. And last out, we have our Kids Creative. This is always so much fun. I always say, you don't have to be a kid to enjoy this. There are always products in here that I like so much. Sometimes there are products that mostly kids would like. But this is a really fun way if you like to journal or if you like keeping notes, like doing your own meal planning, anything that you write down and you wanna get your kids involved in loving it too, this is a fantastic way. We have our paperwork. This is what it looks like on top. I'm not sure what that is. Let's find out. May is petals and pages. There are journaling tip tips like keep your journal in a safe space. Set aside time each day to journal. And then the back tells us everything that will be in here. Right on top. Oh, oh my goodness. I don't even know what this is, but I know I can tell by lifting it out. This is what I could see. My girls are going to love this. They're just gonna love it. I hope there's enough to make two of whatever it is. Oh, there's more than one project. Perfect. I think it says all you will need is scissors. It has seven craft sticks, 227, 227 pom-poms, 18 inches of string, adhesive cardstock. Oh my goodness. This is a party looking to happen. What, does, what do they say it is? It is a pom-pom garden and there are several projects so my two youngest can share this. They are gonna love this. I am excited to have this. This is gonna be fun to do next time they're here. Next out, we have our washi tape. Oh, it's bumblebees. Yeah, the kids don't get this. <laughs> I am keeping that. I am putting it with my journaling stuff. That is so, so cute. I love the bees. Next out, we have stickers. These are pretty. I was trying to see, yep, if they had shiny parts on them, and they do. So some nice big butterfly stickers. I may let the girls have those. Next out, ooh, what is this? I think it might be a pencil case. Ooh, this is gonna be a, this is gonna be a Hunger Games want. I'm gonna have to toss this in the air. The girls, they're all gonna want this. That is so cute. It is clear with the flowers on it, and some of the flowers have little hearts cut out of the middle. Yeah, it's really, really big. Wow, that is cool. See how big it will get? And I could do the same thing to the top. Yeah, the girls are gonna love that. Next out, we have a limited to eight colors, double-sided markers. Always a big hit around here. Never not in need of markers. The girls love markers. Sometimes they get left out. Sometimes they sit around a little too long with one of the ends off. Markers need replacements, what I'm saying. <laughs> and out first, because this is super cute. A couple of pom-poms escaped from the back and they were just down there rolling around it struck me as adorable. We have our pen and our book 
in the kids. And these are both adorable. Bloom where you're planted, and then this is a pin. It's kind of wiggly, and it has a flower on top. It's just, I don't know. I might keep this one too, because I kept it last time, and I do use it up here periodically. We had this oh, probably a year ago, probably spring of last year. This was the floral one that we got, and I kept it up here to write with, because I think they're cute. So I will probably put that over here, and soon I'll have a whole little bouquet in my cup. And the book, I love that when I felt it, it felt kind of hardback, but when you get it out, it's it's softer. It's thinner and softer. I think that's better for kids. I think the hardbacks make them heavy. They make them so rigid. I think this is much more kid-friendly. It's just a nice lined paper. Very pretty, both front and back. I love the little kids box. I think it is so cute. So they have kind of the same theme we do. They get the pen and the journal, some stickers, some markers. They got this really cute, like in the in our adult one, we got the bigger pencil case. They got this little pencil case. And then they get a project. Almost, I think every month, they get some kind of little project they can do. And this is adorable. Don't forget about my washi tape. Nobody mentioned that. That is the journal junk box for May. I will put all of the links down below. Catherine Love will get you 15% off your first box. I know these get big sometimes, so I really appreciate you guys hanging out with me. And I will see you again really soon. Please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you'll know when I have more videos coming out. Take care, guys.